Hello, welcome to Horror of Spice, where everything's nice. I'm Horror Spice. And I'm Mrs. Horror Spice. It is the spicy grind, people. And we bring you Exterminator 2. The Fire Bomb Returns. Robert Genty, star of the television series The Paper Chase and Hawaiian Heat, is the Exterminator, a torch-wielding outlaw vigilante. Mario Van Pebbles, son of the actor-writer-director Melvin Van Pebbles, is X, the leader of an army of thugs who have declared war on New York City. Together, they are a dynamite in the exterminator. When his brother is fried alive by the exterminator during the holdup attempt, the satanic X and his gang decide to, to get even and exterminate the exterminator. The Marauders unleash campaign of violence and uh, barbarism. They break into an armed car and shoot down the police helicopter that tries to stop them. As they terrify the populace and start giving orders to the mafia, it appears they have and have may be invincible until they make one fatal mistake. They cripple the seductive dancer who is the girlfriend of the exterminator. It makes the mistake and quickly regret. Donning the metal mask and army jacket, the arm arming himself with a flamethrower, the exterminator takes the wheel of the night waste removal garbage truck and sets out to clean the city of its malignant human refuge in the confrontation of all-consuming fury, the warlords meet their match. Here's the front again, there's the back, and there's the disc, the VHS. We decided to pair that with Hogagi, Hot Sauce, Terrifying, Curse. Odin's grandson once trapped two dwarven smiths, forcing them to produce a weapon that could cut iron and stone as easy as cloth. Delvin and Durian forged Terrifying, a golden-hilted blade that glows like the flames. Uh, the finishing touch, a curse, of course. Three evils come to any who dare wield Terrifying, and we've caught all three in this bottle. Habanero, Ghost and scorpion peppers caught through the notes of ginger and herbs with a light citrus finish. Uh, this is a Pucker Butt Company. Ooh. Zero calories, 10 milligrams of sodium. Uh, and that is it. Oh, it's got yellow bell peppers, red onion, white wine vinegar, baby carrots. Uh, orange juice, apple cider vinegar, habanero peppers, ghost peppers, scorpion peppers, garlic, ginger, spices, salt, cayenne pepper. Contains no common allergens. Well, it's a pucker butt company, so you know it's going to be good. It's watery. Okay. One, two, three. Lisa thought it was going to be good. Its flavor is nice. I don't taste the most of a flavor. It's a sweet flavor. Mm. How many uh, pipe peppers would you give that? It's very. I'd give it two. The 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 heat is just now starting to pick up in my throat barely. Yeah, two peppers. Flavor wasn't there. Two peppers. Oh, that's true. I'd have to say two peppers too. Because I've given other things that were better three. 
but I hope that does not deter you thoughts on Exterminator 2. If you guys watched our Monday video, <clears throat> we did the first one, and this is the sequel. Well, the sequel delivers. Uh, of course, what I, I liked about the sequel is the only thing that really changed was the story. Because you had the same actor and everything. It was great. I'm so glad that they did that. It really brought it to the stage. And those of you who love 80s um, B-movies know who Mario Von Peebles is. <laughs> Come on, how can you not know who he is? Um... It is always kind of funny to me because he always kind of looks kind of baby face to me. So it's kind of hard to see him in, the, in a tough light. But he really gives it his best. And, but the, the, other, the other bad guys really brought it to the table. Really brought it. Everybody brought their A game. I mean, they really... Um, it was it was fun. It was a riot. So definitely check it out. Um, I think the description on the back doesn't make it have, give it some justice. Well, how many peppers? I would say four out of five. I would give this five out of five peppers yeah. and say that uh, the one thing, uh, everything that they were missing in the first one, they put in the second one. Uh, wouldn't would love to see a remake of, done of this. Uh, well, from Horror of Spice and Mrs. Horror of Spice, y'all stay creepy now. Bye. Bye.